This is a message to the people of Nigeria. Even though I'm not there with you in the physical, we've been making some tangible efforts to try and support your protests on the ground. I know it's getting to a stage where things are heating up and tensions are high, but in my prayers at night, I'm praying for peace and positivity because I know the people on the ground aren't trying to be heard for their own benefit. It's in benefit of the next generation. Me, myself, I've had to take time to understand the issues that people in Nigeria are facing. And why sometimes I'm silent is because I've learned my silence can't be misquoted. So me and my family and my close friends have been trying to do some tangible things and we're organizing many, many care packages for the people on the ground. So even though I'm in my training camp and we're in London, we can support you guys from a distance. December the 12th, I'm competing and after that, I'm going to try and make some plans to come out to Nigeria and meet some of my friends and family and meet some of the people trying to make some long lasting change. But for sure, from London and far and wide, your voices are definitely being heard. So keep on pushing, keep on striving. You have my support through and through. My ears and my eyes have been opened. I understand the issue you guys are facing and for some people, what I'm going to do alone is going to be enough. And for some, it may not be enough. But together, as we hold hands and push for a better change, we will all move forward in a positive direction. So keep on pushing. Your voices have definitely landed on my ears and you definitely have my support. God bless.